local team scores and highlights. Brought to you exclusively by Hiller's Flooring America. What's going on, friends, and welcome into Sports Extra. I'm Julian Mitchell. Can you believe we're here? February is flying on by. Playoffs are already happening in girls hockey. Wrestling and basketball are just around the corner. It's unbelievable, and it means all these games have some more meaning behind them. So let's get started with a battle in the HVL. A great crowd out there in Lake City for a big one. Fifth-ranked Goodhue Wildcats, 11-2 in the conference, but to knock off second-ranked Lake City, who's 11-1. We open up the game with a pass inside to Lake City's Ryan Heisey, who pits in the layup, making the score 2-0. Defense, a big part of this game is Riley Fick. Says, get that stuff out of here, protecting the Lake City lead. Lake City, though, finding their rhythm early. Heisey striking again, puts on some moves in the post, lays it in to make the score 4-0. Goodhue finally gets into this one. Adam Ponsley gets that to drop, makes a tough layup on the block. Two-point game. Goodhue keeps it going. Luke Roshan splashed a three, giving Goodhue a 5-4 lead. Doesn't stop there, though. Goodhue's Gavin Schaefer drills another three for Goodhue, extending their lead to four. But Lake City answers right back. Keegan Ryan makes a three of his own, but Goodhue still up 8-7. Ryan Heisey going to come down here with a pass, drives inside, dishes to Keegan Ryan. That is an easy lay-in. Tigers the lead back at 11 to 10. A really, really great game here. It's Lake City coming away with the close win, 58 to 53 over Goodhue. Some stats here: Hunter Lawrenson, 20 points in the win. Ryan Heisey with 19. Keegan Ryan with 10 all for Lake City. Goodhue's well upsaw, really great game. 25 points, 10 rebounds for the Wildcats. There, a really great battle between those two teams. Moving over to the girls' side now, 7th-ranked Lord Eagles in its final home game of the regular season, taking on 19th-ranked Byron. Eagles started strong. Vivica Breton in the post. Nice footwork for two off the window. Lord up two. Byron came right back, though. Kendra Harvey float pass to Emma Stork. She gets an easy look to tie this game back up. Lord on the other end. Ella Hopkins, this is just too easy. Convinced she doesn't even see the defender. Layup goes down. Here, Eagles off the inbound. That's Lauren Huss. Says, Let me borrow that for a second. Steal and score. Lord on a run up five, but here come the Bears. Taylor Finney, mid range, money. Good bucket. Again, here, Bears. McKenna Schroeder, jump stop, around, layup. That's textbook. Eagle lead is cut to one. The Byron run continues. In transition, Paige Holder keeps a dribble, splits, and one. Byron. Jumps in front here, but it's Lord who's going to win this game at home. They beat Byron 67 to 50. The Eagles with a win elsewhere here. Good Hugh, fourth ranked Wildcats beat Lake City 70 to 35. Sat now with Elizabeth Gadian with 17 points. Good Hugh is now 21 and 3 or 12 and 2 in the HBL. Other set of scores here. Fourth ranked Stewartville beat some Broda Mazeppa handily 79 to 29. That final. Let's go to the boys' side here. It's boys side of the Lord Byron game. Bears going up against the Eagles. Good game in this one. Byron on the kick out, swinging it around at top of the key. Triple goes down. Byron here up five early. They kept this run going. It is passing down inside on the block. That two goes down from the inside to 10 point. Bears lead here. But here comes Lord. They're going to get this down inside. That two goes down to start trimming. This lead away and try and keep things going. Lord up the floor, the drive, pull out to the wing, triple, cash, money. Eagles starting to put a run together here, cut into this deficit, but the Bears had everything working again down inside. Look at that passing. That's a clinic. Well-coached team getting another bucket there in this one. Thus settled in this game. This final score is going to be Byron with a win, 67-46 over Lord Bears. Get that win there at home. Elsewhere in this one, Pine Island beats Christ Household of Faith. Beat them 89 to 64, the final in that game. We are just getting started here on Sports Extra. So to come, a big nine battle. It's the John Marshall Rockets welcome Mankato West to town. Plus, 11th ranked Goodhue puts its 13 game win streak on the line against Lewis and Altura. Will the Super Larks make it to 14 in a row? Find out after this two minute timeout.